Well, little brother, I don't know how much you've heard wherever you are about what's going on in jolly old Europe. But this chap Grindelwald has been making a lot of noise since you've been away. Charismatic blighter. But the Ministry doesn't like him, nor does the International Confederation. He's upset a few of the bigwigs, and he's gone underground. Anything edible in there? No. Livestock? Um, no. Let me take a look. Excuse me, so, sorry, mm. what's the quickest way to Arizona from here? Fly, Molly, you're all home. Trying to catch a fish. Hey, what you doing? Get out of the way! This great city sparkles with the jewels of man's inventions. Movie theaters, automobiles, the wireless, electric lights, all dazzle and bewitch us. But where there is light, there is shadow, friend. Something is stalking our city, wreaking destruction and then disappearing without a trace. Oh, so sorry. My case. Excuse me. Excuse me. I'm trying to get to the bank here. Promptly, when the war ended, gotten a job and put some money away. This is vodka. Everyone who tastes it says it's the best they've ever had. Mr. Kowalski. You gotta try the Pornskis, okay? It's my grandmother's recipe. The orange zest just. <sighs> Mr. Kowalski. Good day to you. What's going on everybody, it's Game of Box and Reviewers here, and welcome to my LEGO Dimensions Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them Story Pack Walkthrough. That's right, this pack is finally out and we can finally play it. And guess what, I just got back from seeing the actual movie and it was amazing. I mean, this, this movie was so good. You know, there was a lot of worry about it because we haven't seen the Harry Potter, you know, Wizarding World for a while recently. And for it to just come out of nowhere, you know, come back out of nowhere, People were worried, is it going to be good? Is, you know, what what's it going to be like? And it, it is absolutely brilliant. I highly recommend anyone to go see it. And the funny thing is, you know, I feel like this movie kind of appeals to both fans who love Harry Potter, you know, love the Wizarding World, but also people who don't. People who don't really like Harry Potter or haven't seen them, they should still go see this because I actually think they'll probably get a good kick out of it. I think they'll really enjoy it. It's a very funny film, a very entertaining film. It's it's brilliant. It's it's awesome, and I'm so excited to get playing through it. So we're playing as Newt Scamander right now. Um, Eddie Redmayne was amazing as Newt. I mean, he did such a good job. This is going to be a really great franchise. It's going to be really good. Uh, I'm just seeing 
I'm not really collecting studs because I know you guys much prefer I don't do that. But I'm just trying to see what uh, what there is. I was trying really hard not to laugh in that introduction video because I always try to make sure you know there's, there's no commentary until I do my little announcement because I just think that's better. But man, there was some funny bits in that. I was trying really hard not to laugh. I mean, Niffler, Niffler was like the Groot of this movie. He absolutely stole the show. Niffler was hilarious. Love him. All right, let's see if we can do this. Reducto. Reducto. Excuse me, sir. If you need access to that private security deposit box, you're gonna need to get in line. Hmm. Oh, oh apologies. It's in a bit of a rush, you see. Don't mind me. Hmm. Cool. I love how Eddie Redmayne has uh, come back and reprised his role as well. That's awesome. Be too conspicuous with your magic in here. Don't want to draw too much attention to myself. Aha! Alright, so we'll build this. There we go. Oh, it's a big coin. Niffler's probably going to run and get that, is he? And then I bet we're going to make Niffler, because I haven't actually made him yet. Which... Um... A lovely shiny coin for you. <laughs> Alright. Come on. Here we go. Whoa! That's done some damage. Better go get that. So, uh, excuse me. So, miss. <laughs> So from what I've heard about this pack when they were working on it, they wanted to kind of go for a, a a Lego Harry Potter 3 kind of thing, if you know what I mean. Like they wanted to kind of, even though it's in Lego Dimensions, they wanted to try and make it as if it, how you would make a third Lego Harry Potter game. And it's essentially, that is what Fantastic Beasts is. It is another ha Harry Potter movie. It's just not about Harry Potter. It's But it is set in the Wizarding World. So it's great to hear that they've kind of approached this pack as if it was a Fantastic Beast game. And thing is, Newt isn't the only character we'll be playing as. We'll also be playing as Queenie and Jacob as well. And I do have Tina, but I think she's only in the fun pack, unless we play as her somehow in the story pack anyway. Maybe they have done that. Maybe you play as Tina in the story pack, but the only way to access her outside of that would be to actually buy her in the fun pack. We'll see. Can I have... I want a Niffler in real life. It's just the cutest thing. <laughs> I feel like uh, they're going to make a lot of money off merchandise of Niffler because everyone's going to love Niffler. Everyone is going to want a Niffler after they've seen Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them. Absolutely. <laughs> right. Now, even though I have seen the movie, obviously, you know, spoiler alert, you know, we are playing through the movie, so you can absolutely expect me to mention some spoilers, but I'm gonna try and not mention spoilers, you know, unless we're close to that scene or in that scene, you know? I don't want to mention the ending, for example, right now, because that would just be stupid. Um, but as we get closer and closer, we'll start to see more and more, and uh, yeah, I'm very excited to see some of the scenes and how they've actually recreated them, because some of them... I don't know. I'm very... I'm kind of confused on how they're actually going to recreate them, but it'll be cool to see. I mean, this is TT Games. It's the LEGO Harry Potter team. They're, they're going to do a great job. I told Arthur Parsons earlier, I was like, I just can't wait to play this. I just want to get home and play it already. Alright, what's this? Press circle. Oh, nice! They added that to the game! Sweet! Well, I think that was in the video, wasn't it? In that uh, video I did, where I showcased all the character abilities. I think it was in there, but um, it's cool to see that because that's kind of like a teleport ability. So this is like the first teleporting character we have. Seeing me, because we don't really have any teleporters in Lego Dimensions yet. All right. No, 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 no. Oh no. No, no. Uh oh. Run, Newt. Is this uh, just to go back over there? I think it is. Wait, what's this say? Yeah, apparate access. Wait, how many how many characters can do that? I wonder. Oh, Harry, Voldemort, Newt, and Tina can all do that. That's cool. All right, nice. So, does Newt say the spells when he shoots them as well? He's not saying them right there, but uh, maybe if we, I'm trying to get him to see if he can do another spell. I'm also very excited to see how they handle the briefcase in this game because uh, that was such a, a, a really spectacular thing in the movie is the briefcase. Like, you think you know about it right now, but if you haven't, you know, until you see the movie, you don't understand what that briefcase is. I mean, it's 
it's so cool. It is just so, 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 so cool. I love it. I really hope they have, you know, it is used in the game in the way I'm expecting. Um, it might not be. If it's not, then, you know, oh well. It could be a better way. We'll have to wait and see. But uh, I'm sure they've done a good job. Definitely. Alright. Let's uh, fill this up with water. I imagine we're probably going to play as Jacob in a sec. Curious to see what he can do. Yeah. Maybe he throws food. <laughs> That'd be good. <laughs> he throws uh, bakery stuff. Aha! Right. Hop up there. Hey! Thought I'd never get a hold of one of these. <laughs> it's so great to hear um, Eddie Redmayne's voice when you're playing as new. That's really cool. Like, you know, like I said, I don't mind hearing uh, archive audio for Harry Potter, but it obviously it is so much better when the actor comes back and reprises their role, like what Eddie has done here. I mean, that was really awesome of Eddie. I saw some pictures on Twitter from some of the devs, uh, and, you know, they said he's really cool, and he's a really funny guy, and he, he seemed like he had a blast recording lines for Newt in this game, you know, he must have had a lot of fun reprising that the role of that character. Which is great, you know, it's nice to know that an actor enjoys playing the character that they portray. Really cool. There's a stud behind here, I just want to get it. Well, I thought there was, I can see it. Ah, whatever, doesn't matter. We'll just turn this now, and there we go. Through the door. Also, the music in Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them was really nice as well. Love the music. Really good. Alright, here we go. <laughs> Come back, Niffler! And there's Jacob. Look at me, that's right. There we are. So I'm your mother. <laughs> nice. Oh, cool. I bet we can play as Jacob now. Down here. Oh, oh my. Are you robbing the bank? <laughs> Don't be silly. I'm just here to retrieve my pet over there. What is that thing? Is that a rat? I think that's new lines. Do we get to play as him? Mm, no. Oh, yes, we do. Yes, Jacob is playable. I know he probably won't be able to do much, but still, it's nice to have another character from Fantastic Beasts that's playable. He does throw stuff! Yes! I knew he'd be able to do that. I love that. That's awesome. He throws pies. Oh, he's ground pounds a cake! Oh, that is cool. I don't care what anyone says. That's awesome. I like that. Um, does he do anything with Circle? I don't think he does. Okay, let's go back to Newt. But still, that is awesome. I like that. Very, very, very cool. Okay. Anything over here, Newt? Now, supposedly, in year two, they have thrown in tons of Easter eggs. Like, tons and tons and tons of Easter eggs from loads of different franchises. Some that aren't even in the game. As in, like, you know, not... Basically, you have, say for example, you had Flintstones in year one. They've done more stuff like that. You know, franchises that don't have packs, but do make an appearance in the game. And I love that kind of stuff. That's awesome. Magic. <laughs> Probably just some newfangled device. Wait. Did you just say magical? <laughs> Sweet babka! Now you're breaking stuff? Shh, keep your voice down. <laughs> Alright, new. We're gonna... Oh, okay, alright, so this is uh, the grow keystone, isn't it? The one where you grow big or you grow small. Okay, so first off... Uh, let me see, which... Oh, wait, hang on. I forgot new can do that. There we go. Oh, what? That was nothing! We didn't even need to do that. It didn't do a thing. Okay, that's fine. Uh, is there anything around here I'm supposed to destroy? No, I don't think there is. Okay, so what we'll do is we'll put Newt on the toy pad, make him big, and then we'll throw that up there, like that. There we go. I just wanted to give you your egg back, but you got it now, so... <laughs> Nonsense. This will only take a second. And I'm a giant Newt Scamander right now. He's probably freaking out. Poor Jacob. He just wanted to get, you know, his bakery done, but now he's seeing a giant wizard before his very eyes. Okay, 
Uh, can we make? Oh no, we can't. Can we? I was gonna say, it's it's funny when you look at a character on the screen, you don't actually see them in. You know, you see them on the screen, but then you look to your toy pad and you're like, oh wait, I don't have a Jacob minifigure. <laughs> so I'm wondering if we're gonna play as Tina in the actual pack. Or, uh, uh, like in the story, or you have to have Tina to do it. I I'm very curious to see if that's how it works. Because she had a big role in the movie. She was very important. So I kind of was confused why they chose her as the figure. Because I would have thought she'd just be included in the story pack. Um, but it's great to see that, you know, she's still added to the game. I kind of thought one of uh, the bad characters would have would have uh, got a pack. But I feel like they might do stuff like that in the future. Because I'm pretty certain that Fantastic Beasts 1 isn't the only Fantastic Beast content we'll see to LEGO Dimensions. They will probably do the sequels as well. I hope so. If not, then I would love to see a full Fantastic Beasts game where we play for all the movies. And all the Harry Potter movies. Then they could do archive audio for every single one. That would be awesome. Would love to see that. Oh, you're going to steal the money, huh? Security! Oh, no. He's going to press the big red button. What we're gonna do now, Newt? Freeze! Drop any weapons you may be carrying now! Are we gonna attack them, or do we just disappear like in the film? We ain't looking for any trouble, boys. This has been a complete misunderstanding. <laughs> He's got the keys. Oh, I love Diffler so much. Yes. Come on, come on now. I've got lots of shiny things in my case. This isn't gonna work, is it? All right. So do we fight the police? I guess we do. All right, Newt. Terribly sorry about this. Oh, we're just gonna freeze them. I see. Forgive me, what have I gotten myself into? <laughs> oh, I see. Yeah, so we're just gonna kind of put them in a daze. All right, that's not bad. Shh, you'll scare them away. Uh, am I doing that right? No, I'm doing it wrong. Yeah, that's that's it. There we go. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I got it now. Okay. And then drop that down. Yes, very nice. Purple stud. Alright, that's for Finn. We don't have that. Wait, it's, um... Oh, no, it's gone. Ah, <laughs> oh, he's running away again. Come here, Niffler. Ooh. Hey, look, there's a flash headpiece there. You see? It's over there, look. There's the flash's headpiece. Pretty cool. Hey! Stop. Stop, police. No, wait. I'm trying to, uh... No, not that. How do you... There we go. Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah. It's wanting me to use it on there. I was... I thought it was something to do with this, uh, this shelf here. But I don't think it is. Okay. And now. Guardium Leviosa. Okay, cool. Now what we're going to build. Ooh. Hmm. Right. I'm not sure Alohomora is going to work with these more intricate muggle logs. You can't just break it, wait. Muggle, what's a muggle? What? <laughs> <laughs> Am I doing that right? Oh, it's in the middle, yeah, of course. Yeah, there we go. You just had to drill it in the middle, basically. <laughs> Look at Niffler trying to pull that down. <laughs> you silly little thing. Right. That's enough, Niffler. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, he's, he's in a daze. Now, if you can just stay still. Oh, oh no. <laughs> uh. I love him. I love Niffla so much. He's just such a funny character. Just the thing. Such a funny creature. Right. What's this? What is that? A stick insect? Oh, nice! Oh, that's cool. Its long limbs are especially good at picking locks like this. That is so cool. Just reach on in there, Bicket. Now come. I wasn't expecting stuff like this. This is awesome. Wait. Hang on. Oh, I see. Wait, hang on, I'm confused. Green, green, green. Oh, right, okay. Da, da, da. 
Yes! That is awesome! I wasn't expecting cool stuff like this. Okay, is that one? That one? Wait, hang on. I think I did it wrong. Try that again. Middle, left, right. Okay. Middle, left, right. Aha! And last one. Middle, right, left. Middle, right, left. That is really cool. I wasn't expecting a little mini game like that. That's awesome. And the policeman's still trying to hit me. Go away. Aha! Now we're in. You little scamp. Buddy, I don't think that's a rat in there. Are you sure that's your pet? That doesn't look quite right. Is that some kind of fake wall? Hmm. What is that? Oh, look at all the bananas and everything. Is that, uh... Yeah, I think, is that one of the Adventure Time walls that you need? Oh, use Defendo on it. D can Newt do Defendo? I'd imagine he can, I just want to check. Yeah, he can. And Tina can as well. Okay, cool. No, I pressed the wrong button. Sorry about that. No! Sorry, guys. Ooh, we actually destroyed them that time. I, I didn't intend to do that. My bad. Okay. This time. This time, this time, this time. No, I keep pressing the wrong thing. There we go. Now cut around it. Like this. I don't think, think uh, Defindo even featured in the movie. So it's cool to see it here instead. Hey! Don't kill Newt Scamander. I'll have to make a note of that. <laughs> Okay, he's knocked out. That's fine. Uh, right. Let's build this. What's that gonna do? Ooh. What's he doing? Ooh. Oh, however, it looks like my new friend might need some help. Okay. Sorry, sir. Okay. Alright, cool. Yes, I haven't actually built that, as you can probably tell. Um, not this time. I, could, I was going to try and do it before, but um, obviously the instructions are in the level and I couldn't find them anywhere else. Um, so I've decided to just put the toy tag on the thing and just continue on with the walkthrough, basically. But I will build it at some point, um, probably later on. Uh, but I feel like, you know, I just want to keep playing the level because this level is really cool. Alright, so how do you... Oh, nice! So when you actually play as Niffler, you don't ride him. You're just playing as him properly. Oh, no! What? How could you do that, officer? How could you destroy such a cute little thing? That's a terrible thing you just did. I'm trying to... Oh, circle. All right, there we go. Hey! There you go, Jacob. You're free. Sweet. What are you going to do, Newt? I don't even know this guy. i a terrible mistake. <laughs> For the last time, you pilfering person, pours off what doesn't belong to you. Now, unfortunately, you have seen it far too much. So, if you wouldn't mind if you just stand there, over in a jiffy. <laughs> Commander, and you are? You could not have chosen a worse time to let that creature loose. I'm taking you in. Taking me in where? Magical Congress, the United States of America. You took care of the Nomadge. And you wiped his memory, right? The Nomadge with the case? Uh. Yeah. That's a Section 3A, Mr. Scamander. So, Tina. Oh. What's all this about? 
Mr. Graves, sir, this is Mr. Scamander. He has a crazy creature in that case, and it got out and caused mayhem in a bank. We have just as much right to exist as we do. So with proper protection, and not to mention an educational program, which is what I've been working on. Protecting them? What about the statute of secrecy? Not to mention the claws and the fangs and the flames and the venom. <clears throat> All right, then. Let's see the little guy. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no, Jacob. Sorry, Grandma. Is that it? Yep, that's it. Alright. Accruing interest. Level complete. Alright, cool. That was a nice start to the Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them story pack. Do, 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 do. Now, I imagine this will be like the Ghostbusters one where you'll go from the level and then you go a bit into the adventure world and a bit into the level again and stuff like that. It'll be a nice combination of the two, which I liked. I definitely liked that about the Ghostbusters one, so hopefully they've done the same here. Alright, guys, so that's pretty much it for this video. Stay tuned for the next part real soon. And as always, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe.